Hey everyone, Shin Virtuality here, and all I gotta say is guns up, guns down, let's get those guns to Funky Town. Uh, we're playing Guns Up Mobile. Uh, new strategy uh, war game uh, for mobile. Uh, so let's tap to continue and see if we can get into a couple of skirmishes and see what this is all about. Right into the action. Commander, our transport truck is carrying troops to engage the enemy. Deploy some units now! Yes, we'll, we'll deploy some units. Uh, so yeah, this is sort of... Uh, you deploy your units. Oh. Uh, uh, vehicles have abilities. Tap the super shot, then tap the target to destroy the bunker. So tap and tap. Boom! Uh, enemies and structures drop commander abilities, tap to collect. Yep, I'll definitely do that. Uh, <laughs> it's going to explain. All right. Uh, drop commander abilities into the field to aid your units. We'll do that. There, I've aided. Um, but as long as you have room to deploy more units, then you're able to do so. Uh, I think if as long as you have... Uh, not used up all your inventory slots and have the energy in order to uh, to deploy them. Uh, okay, so so we'll deploy some more units. Uh, we'll take that enemy troops. And we'll deploy some more units in order to get ourselves through this beginning tutorial stage. Uh, it's nice that they keep giving us uh, bombs to uh, take out enemy structures with. Let's redeploy some troops. We can, we can deploy lots of troops. Apparently our inventory slots, I think, go up to 60 if I'm not mistaken. So we can have 60 troops over on the field. And we haven't even gotten close to fulfilling that yet. But as long as some energy is around... Oh, here you got the enemy stronghold. So let's, let's get it out of commission. Super slow mo and three stars. So nice little stuff, and you get some supplies afterwards. So that was the tutorial. I. Yeah, I claimed all the pre-registration. I actually just played like a couple of episodes, but I did want to see if the uh, if the tutorial could be replayed again, and apparently it can. So it just took whatever save I have out of the cloud. Um, so I haven't played too much into this. Like I did the offensive tutorial and I did the defense tutorial. So same thing. Uh, you deploy troops while enemy troops are attacking your base, and as long as you can hold off the waves, then you win the round. Uh, but we got a couple of things to upgrade here, so let's see. Generates missions over time. Uh, you know what? Let's do that. Okay. 
construct a gold mine in the headquarters. So I got a, all right, I have some, some objectives to do here. Where is my gold mine? That's my oil refinery. That's not a gold mine. That's my gold mine. Uh, but my worker's already working on something. So, right, I got to wait for this to finish before starting up a new project. Claim the free items at least, so and that's about it. All right, upgrade complete. All right, so now that we have some stuff, let's up upgrade our gold mine. I'm sure it'll be useful. It's probably little things that you can accumulate over time. Uh, all right, well, let's get that achievement. You know how much I like achievements. Uh, and here's where you can manage your troops, I guess. Uh, so, Grenader, we got our medic there, our sergeant, epic sergeant, and assault. Uh, so, this will probably be our f more frontline person. Oh, I'm missing resources. Okay. Uh, I don't have anything to equip with. So. I don't think I can upgrade any of these people. Nope. Hmm. Well, that's useful, but I guess that's why we gotta play a little bit more of the game anyway. Yep, there. Gold mine. Oh, I leveled up too. What do I get? Oh, I get some items. Maybe I'll actually be able to... Uh, do I want to upgrade? I'm just going to take another... I want my worker to actually construct... Uh, can I... Oh, no, I need a level 3 command center before I can do anything here. And while this is my command center, uh, need level two veteran lodgings stuff. Okay, so since we got since we got some time, let's see if we can start a war. I get to begin opening a crate that will open in an hour and 20 minutes. Yay! Uh, okay, let's see if I can read. And no tanks. All right, well, might as well go in with all the units that I have at my disposal. Grenader on the field. So yeah, just keep uh, keep things going with 
get some smokes out. easy enough. And we got some stuff to collect. Okay guys, we spent a little bit more time with Guns Up Mobile. Uh, turns out, um, I don't know, I don't know if I want to say I was misled, but I thought this was a combat game with a sidebar of base building. Uh, but this is a base building game with a sidebar of combat. Uh, let's get our supplies. Uh, munitions and gold are going to be the main currencies that you need to collect here. Because uh, it seems like everything takes either um, one of the two or both. And at some point, I would like to collect my gold, please. All right, well, whatever. So this is your main base. You got buildings to, no, <laughs> there it finally goes. Um, you got uh, your sort of mines or refineries in order to create the currencies. Uh, we don't even have the oil refinery yet because we need a level three command center, which is this structure here. Um, so we're ready to upgrade it other than the fact that we need supplies to do so. So that will take a little bit. Um, and then down here, you can level up your troop carrier. Uh, I think you got engineering for, I guess, upgrades or whatnot. Uh, and then uh, veteran lodgings. Uh, we needed to build the veteran lodgings in order to unlock the level three requirement for the command center. Uh, so we'll get to that in a minute, because getting from level 2 to level 3 will take about half an hour. So a lot of these things will have timers that are attached to it, and you just either run out the timer or pay the premium currency in order to fast track it. Now, this is your battlefield in terms of defending your base uh, from attackers. So when people come to attack, and we'll go through that in a little bit, um, you have structures and defenses, uh, walls, barrels, sandbags, um, these things, bunkers, that's it. <laughs> bunkers, sniper towers, all sorts of stuff. So you can set up your field for defending your base and hopefully defending it successfully. Um, and as we had done in the other sort of part of the video, the earlier part, uh, we went to attack and whenever you attack, you're attacking someone else's base. Uh, but before we go into the attack again, let's go into our store because we have a key to open up one of the supply crates. And I'm hoping these supply crates will have some currencies that we can sort of get uh, get um, stuff upgraded with. So yeah, contains five items. We got a key, so let's use it. Uh, and apparently we got a medal for leveling up, I guess, whatever that troop is, mercenary, which we do not have. So that's always nice. So you can pay, pay premium currency at some point when I can talk. You can pay premium currency to open up your crates. Uh, oh, we can confirm a purchase for a grenade or metal. Will that actually get us uh, times one? I don't think it will because I think you need more more metals in order to get even your basic upgrades. Uh, and what's this? Um, oh, that's a, that's a item, right? Yeah, gas mass times one. Uh, you can pay premium currency to fill out your um, 
I guess, currencies. But uh, I did have to do that for a couple of the previous upgrades. We're going to hold off for now and hopefully get some later on. Uh, so let's go into our inventory because we got a medal for the Grenader uh, and we only have one so we need five to unlock their first of four skills. Uh, so it'll be a little bit of a waiting game in terms of getting your characters all to the highest level I guess with all their abilities intact. Um, but let's let's start a war War. War never changes. Uh, we also have another crate to open. I got one of these, uh, I guess, higher than the basic crates. So hopefully we get some good stuff. Uh, okay. And then we can start to unlock. And we can rush it by paying 16 gems, which we're not going to do. Um, again, it sort of it sort of seems to me that it limits um, trying to raid other bases because you only have so many slots for um, prize crates, and since it takes so long to open them, like um, why would I want to raid any more bases if all my crate spots are filled out waiting for them to open? But eh, I don't know. Uh, defend. We'll do a defend later, and then I wanted to get my uh, command center up to level three because it does say that there is a zombies mode, which I want to see if it's any different than the the two um, the two modes that are currently in here. So let's go on another raid, and this sort of shows you your layout of whoever it is that you're attacking, and apparently I'm attacking Ricky. Uh, so um, they have some walls and a bunker and some sandbags and that's about it. So this probably will be pretty easy. Let's uh, head to our loadout and move out. Uh, and then I start standard troops, put in uh, an elite, some more troops. Uh, Grenader and some medics to keep my guys pretty healthy and just keep up with uh, getting getting troops resupplied if you need to I said this probably will not take too long we'll make short work of that bunker get a firebomb in the process Uh, you know what, let's... Lots of stuff and another crate for us to open. And we'll make short work of this for sure. Yeah, three stars and... Some... Some veterans. And again, some stuff that you can collect at the end of the raid, as well as some um, some currencies that you'll need in terms of leveling up. So now that we've done an attack, let's go through quickly a defense scenario. Enemy forces. Uh, okay, so we've completed stage one. You know what, let's let's try a stage stage two. Complete defend stage two. Alright. Um, we don't have any others other than those two, smoke bomb and our our bomb, our bomb bomb. So here's our wave one, here's our base, fully fortified. And here comes the enemy troops. So let's get them at, the, at an immediate disadvantage. 
take out what we can. Uh, I don't resupply troops here. They'll come automatically uh, once they're ready. So here comes the next wave. And I'm not sure if my base is is worth keeping like that. It probably isn't. Uh, I took out my sniper tower. Oh, we got five waves here. Jeez. All right, well, let's hope that. Uh, they hit me with some sort of flame. Oh, and these guys got an elite coming in. Uh, let's smoke out here. Hopefully it's enough to whittle down their troops. Yeah, they took my, my, la my first line of defense. So... I don't know if I'm going to survive this. Well, now it's a battle of the elites. Waiting for my power up to come out. I think it's my only chance to survive this scenario. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that was rough. All right, well, let's. Let's continue on here. So, yeah, I may have to uh, rejigger some stuff, maybe buy some some more bunkers or outposts or some, some sort of defending structures and level everything up because, uh, of course, everything needs to level up. But for now, I want to see, so the upgrading of this is going to take 76 of each, so quite a bit. Let's hit the store. Uh, see, I can't even collect uh, more, more munitions. It's not letting me. It's, it's it's allowing me to buy just enough. That's accept that and uh, let's buy one more of the gold uh, and then head back because we want to upgrade this and that's gonna take some time. So collect some of our stuff again what we'll do is we'll wait for that to get to level three and uh, we'll head back and see if uh, the zombie mode is anything anything worth uh, playing uh, like the other two modes so we'll be back when it's ready Alrighty, and we're back with an upgrade complete, so let's get into it. And... Oh, 
Yep, we got our new game mode. And we got ourselves the grunt. Alright, well, we got that achievement done. Um, doesn't seem that much different than the last one, but hey, <laughs> at least we get more stuff now, right? So let's get our... Let's get our ammunition, munitions, and gold, and let's start... Well, let's get our crate, since we have one. Yep, more stuff. And we'll start another one. Uh, but we'll quickly go into a quick zombies game and see... Uh, protect your... Your attempt from a zombie invasion. All right, fair enough. Let's see what this has to offer. Zombie stage one. Uh, okay, so I guess we can load out our people and our abilities, and we can head into the battlefield. Wave one. Oh, so we're uh, let's get some healers. Alright, so much like the attacking one, you have to sort of bring out more, more people, more soldiers. Uh, and you have a list of abilities. So let's start using some of our power-ups. And sort of mis misplace that uh, that fire bomb. Yeah, but we're still in pretty good. We're still in pretty good spirits. Monster kill! Monster kill! Now let's see if we can get a monster kill here. We do have one big zombie trying to come up on us. Uh, you know what? This is a pretty good time for focus fire if ever I seen one. Oh, just in time. Take that. Oh, defeat? No! <laughs> Alright. You know what? We'll try it again. Uh, it's very possible that my guys aren't upgraded enough, but uh, we'll give it another shot. Uh, we do have a level 1... Can I not upgrade from here? Probably not. Alright, I'm going to upgrade some units. Give me a minute. Uh, and can we... Nope. All our supplies are already in use. So that's about as good as he's going to get. But we'll try it one more time. Uh, load out. Yep. Everything looks good. Try and get more soldiers out rather than healers. We don't really needed any healers. Maybe the fact that we had healers taking up slots for us 
wasn't working too much in our favor. This seems a little bit more doable. Uh, let's get some more grunts out and hopefully I guess he uh, got some of our guys with his death, but at least we were victorious this time, so you know what? I'll take it. Yeah. And some more stuff to collect, but you, this should give you guys an idea of what Guns Up Mobile is all about. Um, I don't know if it's something that I'll be sticking with long term, but uh, you know what? if it does interest you, you'll find it for free on the Play Stores. If you enjoyed the video, assault that like button, leave me a comment, or subscribe to my channel for more mobile gaming goodness, because you never know what I'll be picking up next. This has been Shin Virtuality. Game on, have fun, and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.